user agent it identify the client program accept it shows the media format the client can accept accept character set it shows the character set the client can handle accept encoding it shows the encoding scheme the client can handle accept language it shows the language the client can accept authorization it shows what permission the client has host it shows the host and port number of the client date it shows the current date upgrade it specify the preferred communication protocol cookie it returns the cookie to the server if modified since if the file is modified since a specific date a response message consists of status line header line blank line and sometimes a body the first line in a response message is called the status line there are three fields in this line separated by spaces and terminated by a carriage written and line field they are version status code and phrase the first field defines the version of http protocol currently 1.1 the status code field defines the status of the request it consists of three digit codes in the 100 range are only informational 200 range indicate the successful request 300 range indicate redirect the client to another url 400 range indicate an error at the client side 500 range indicate an error at the server side the status phrase explain the status code in the text form response message after the status line we can have zero or more response header lines each header line sends additional information from the server to the client each header line has a header name a colon a space and a header value the body contains the document to be sent from the server to the client the body is present unless the response is an error message header and descriptions are uh, given below this example retrieves a document first client request the server then server responds to client client wants to send a web page to be posted on the server conditional request a client can add a condition in its request in this case the server will send the requested web page if the condition is met or inform the client otherwise one of the most common conditions imposed by the client is the time and date the web page is modified the client can send the header line if modified since with the request to tell the server that it needs the page only if it is modified after a certain point in time example cookies an http cookie is a small piece of data that a server sends to a user's web browser web has functions that need to remember some information about the clients the browser may store the cookie and send it back to the same server with a later request typically an http cookie is used to tell if two requests come from the same browser keeping a user logged in for example it remembers stateful information for the stateless http protocol cookies are mainly used for three purposes session management personalization tracking 
session management, logins, shopping carts, game scores or anything else the server should remember. Personalization, user preferences, themes and other settings. Tracking, recording and analyzing user behavior. Web Caching Proxy Servers HTTP supports proxy servers. A proxy server is a computer that keeps copies of the responses to reason request. The HTTP client sends a request to the proxy server. The proxy server checks its cache. If the re response is not stored in the cache, the proxy server sends the request to the corresponding server. Incoming responses are sent to the proxy server and stored for further requests from other clients. The proxy server reduces the load on the original server, decreases traffic and improves latency. However, to use the proxy server, the client must be configured to access the proxy instead of the target server. Proxy server location the proxy servers are normally located at the client side. A client computer can also be used as a proxy server in small capacity that stores responses to requests often invoked by the client. In a company, a proxy server may be installed on computer LAN to reduce the load going out of and coming into the LAN. An internet service provider with many customers can install a proxy server to reduce the load going out of and coming into the ISP network. Thank you.